Hey guys, welcome back to Tactical Expedition. Today I have this exciting news. Look at this from TechArt. Do you guys know what this is? It's a genuine tech art product from Germany for 2022 Taikon. Made in Germany. Something special. It's like opening a Noah's Ark. No, not Noah's Ark. Indiana Jones, the Lost Ark. <laughs> wow, look at this foam. Okay, so this must be some glue and insulation kit. Okay. It's a real carbon fiber. Wow, it's super light. But problem is, look at this. It's open. How do I install this? Oh no. Oh no. So I, I love this design. At the end, it pops out just like that. So I'm gonna put it behind the Taikan right now. Beautiful Taikan. You know, when you look at it, it's too white over here. You know what I mean? So I was gonna put this uh, spoiler, so hopefully it will look something like this. Looks very nice. This one is Taycan's real carbon fiber, just like this. And this is Tesla's carbon fiber, very similar. Okay, so I opened the package that it came with. This is a support card, installation QR code. I don't know if I can do this. This is a uh, glue. And this is made in Switzerland, so I have to use this and that. Oh my gosh, I'm doomed. Let's see if I can do it or not. If not, I'll take it to a place where they do tech art installation near Los Angeles or Orange County and I just get this installed but it's a beautiful piece it looks really really good we're temporarily putting the rear spoiler and try to get that gap perfect it's very very hard to measure so i'm just going by my eyes so that's that side gap and this side gap so what do you guys think just different lighting different curvatures and this one See, it's gonna be glued and it's gonna be pressed down just like that. So this one too, it's gonna be pressed down. By the way, look at this quality of carbon fiber. Amazing, amazing. And that's the distance here. And also when you apply the glue, this is not a double-sided tape like I showed you. So we have to press this down, see? There's a little bit of a give. It's gonna be pressed down and it's gonna be multiple taps. I just wanna mark it with the blue tape and know the exact location. And I love this end design up out here. Each end has that little bump, gives you that amazing look. And I think that's why the Tech Art rear spoiler is the best looking spoiler for Taikan. Okay, before the spoiler was there, it's it's all white here, too much white, but because of that black break in the middle, that makes it much more aggressive. And it just looks wider too, when you really look at it. It's very well built. It fits perfectly. The curvature, and I wish it was like a double-sided tape, easy to apply, but I have to apply with the glue. <laughs> Very difficult process. And if I mess it up, I think it's over. If you have some extra money, just uh, go to the shop. <laughs> Only reason I'm doing it at home is because, uh, you know, I'm a YouTuber. I wanted to show you if you get it on your own, not from the shop, maybe I can show you how to install it, you know, the right way and the wrong way. <laughs> Hopefully there's no wrong way. So with the painter's tape, I marked the uh, areas. So even if I take the spoiler off, it's gonna create that line so i know exactly where it is that's the line too it follows the line tech guard it's very very classy it looks like oem porsche part but it is not and then once i apply the, the glue it's gonna be held like this even more tape for 12 hours then if there's any gap or air pockets i have to seal that with uh, that same uh, 
sealer. Look at this, I just took this off so I can sand this down according to the direction. Use 180 grit of sandpaper and just sand it down. See, this is just like thin piece of uh, carbon fiber. It's so light, look at this, amazing. And this is the, the area where I have to attach back to the car. Okay, so I got the sandpaper. I'm gonna just sand it over here because uh, the glue is supposed to go not to the edge, but a little bit over here, here. So when it gets pressed down, it kind of spreads and it doesn't come out, you know? And uh, glue is supposed to go all the way to the edge on top right here. I'm gonna just sand it down because it's kind of rough right now, like that. It's becoming smooth over here. Okay, so I sanded everything and then I'm wiping off all the dust with a baby wipe. So I cut it in diagonal. If you can and installation's cheap, just just take it to the shop. <laughs> Gosh. So I'm applying it a little bit away from the edge because that's the instruction. High up on the edge, I'm gonna make it thin with using my fingers. Just wear a glove and then do that. You know the access? It's easy to clean with the baby wipe. It just comes off. Everything just comes off. So um, once you apply it to the car and uh, it gives you a problem or it goes over, you can just use a baby wipe or some kind of a cleaner to just clean it off. This uh, is not an immediate glue. I think it just takes about 12 hours to cure and uh, make it like permanent. But you, right now it's a very uh, soft and you can play around with it. To apply it, you need two people, okay? Ask your friend or wife or uh, girlfriend or significant other uh, because once you make a mistake, it's gonna be messy all around, okay? My wife helped me a lot and she got mad because I was yelling at her. But anyways, <laughs> hopefully it worked. Oh my gosh. So tape everywhere. I'm gonna wait 12 hours. 12 hours has passed. So I'm gonna remove some tape and hopefully it is decent and attached permanently. Yeah, use the masking like a painter's tape because it doesn't leave any residue. It gets uh, removed real, real nicely. See, very easy. You see the actual Porsche spoiler. This is a movable spoiler up and down. And when I pull this up, that's good because this thing moves, not the spoiler. So on that side, seems like it's permanent. Thank you.